Hey guys, Nursery88 here, and welcome back to another video. This time I'm going to be showing you how to uh, op properly in CSGO. So the first thing you want to do is go into your options and your keyboard and mouse settings. You want to make sure that your raw input is on and your mouse acceleration is off. Mouse acceleration makes it so that when you're when you move your mouse across your mouse pad that it'll not be consistent. It'll move it more than it needs to move. Um, the raw input takes the raw DPI from your mouse and puts it into the game so that uh, it's not based on the game, it's based on your mouse. So that now, so can you see what I'm doing here? Um, just because you can double zoom doesn't mean that you should everywhere. Um, it's better in some places than others. But for the most of the time, you want to be in your solo first zoom, being at a door, and you're waiting for someone to come out. Unless you're DMG and higher, you don't want to be aiming next to the door like this, because there's no way you're going to be able to shoot him the moment he comes out. You want to be aiming to the right a little bit, where this this glowing spot from the, the light and the sun is. Uh, so that they will walk in your crosshair, and then you don't have to uh, flick to get them. Because in a situation like this, you can over flick it really easily. If you didn't know this already, is that if you're shooting, you can be 100% accurate. Um, no matter what gun it is, I'm just using a deagle, but. You can see that it's 100% accurate except for that one shot right there. That's because the moment that you change direction on the keyboard is, is the moment that you're perfectly accurate no matter what. So you can use this to your advantage. So let's say you're peeking a corner, right? Let's say someone is watching. You can be 100% accurate by abusing this. The other key, you're 100% accurate. Because if you notice, the crosshair is blurred when I'm moving, but as soon as I turn, it's 100% accurate. So if you're in the corner, as soon as you can do the other person, you just hit the opposite key. So right now I'm hitting A, and then as soon as I peek, I push D, and then I'm 100% accurate. Um, so you can use this pretty much anywhere. So for example... Um, if you don't do it right, you can mess up. Mess up. Another thing is that when you shoot the op, you can see that after he ejects the used ammo, there's it still moves for about, I don't know, a 25th of a second. So until your finger is back in the uh, the trigger, back on the trigger, that's when you want to shoot that, because then you're going to be accurate. Because I mean, I'm sure we've all experienced the, the parts, I mean those times where you thought you, you shot someone, but you didn't. And that's because when you when you fire when you're firing really like fast, you're not gonna be 100% accurate unless you let that the op reset itself. So you just kind of gotta learn where the common spots are of the map where people would be. So for example, mid doors, there's usually a person right there. So as soon as you're coming around the corner, you can just shoot and maybe get a, a kill. Uh, there's usually a person back of sight, or barrels, or plat. Plat is more common in barrels in the higher ranks, but in the lower ranks, back of sight is a lot more common. Um, in order to pre-aim back of sight, you, there's this little line below the B. You can 
use that in order to pre-aim back at site. So, for example, if I zoom in and my line is in line with the other line, as soon as I peek out, you can see that I'm ready for for headshot, for headshot to get him back at sight. Same thing for barrels. Um, in order to get the the platform, you just need to aim in the middle of the the top part and then peek out. Another common place is long, where you can peek out and get him right there. You can get the person right there. You can get the dumpster could be right here in the barrel because some people are assholes like that. And common place is pit too. So there's this little green patch right there. They're they'll usually peak right above that. So you know like right here. And if you can see I'm right in front uh only sticking out. And that's because my head is So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Um I'll be back with some more tutorials this week and another episode of Guess the Rank soon. I um, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time.